Well, as is often the case this time of the year, we have rapidly shifted gears. This is our Keeneland Live Weather Bug camera. You can still see a hint of the accumulated snow that's out there, but it is uh, by and large uh, really going away in a hurry, which is welcome news. Now, some side streets in Lexington are still problematic. Had a lot of slush yesterday, and uh, you could have some slick spots this morning. Uh, but overall, we're in better shape. We have had some rain recently as well. There's the snow up over Michigan. It's still full on winter up there. But a large part of the United States, the weather is more or less benign. And this is interesting. If you look at the snowpack, the snow analysis, this is satellite analysis. We're down to the continental United States with 47% snow coverage, down from the record peak of uh, over 70%. Last week, you can still see the most of it across, of course, the Great Lakes, Upper Midwest, New York, uh, New England states, where you'd expect it, and uh, back toward the mountains there. Uh, but it's gone by the wayside and gone away down south as that Arctic air has done the same. So all of a sudden, we're talking about rain chances. We've got a low end chance for a few showers around tomorrow, and then a better chance for rain going into the weekend. So we're warming up. We also are going to be unsettled. Our rainfall. 24 hours higher in our southeastern counties. You had a good solid uh, quarter to almost half an inch of rain uh, down there. So it was a little on the wet side. And for today, no real worries about precipitation. We'll start out with a few clouds, partly sunny. Go mostly sunny later on this, uh, this afternoon. And then here comes a cold front that'll go through midday. Could spark an isolated shower or two. But it looks like there'll be a post frontal round of showers firing up. So a quick hit later in the evening, fairly limited in scope. Uh, but there'll be a chillier setup behind that as high pressure ridges in and the winds shift. It's 36 degrees now. Uh, we've got wind gusts that are still popping around 20 miles per hour. So today will be breezy. Tomorrow it'll get gusty as that front comes through. But look at the temperatures. Our average high this time of the year, 48. We're shooting for low to even mid 50s tomorrow. Of course, cold front will knock us back into the 40s. But even a 47 degree high, it's very close to our average high. So we're maintaining that consistent around average or above average uh, temperature setup. And the six to 10 day temperature outlook is encouraging if you like it a little warmer. Uh, going into early March, we're still showing an above normal trend. So those temperatures could stay propped up for a while. Low 50s today, partly to mostly sunny. It's breezy out there, but it should be a nice afternoon and another day with sunshine and well above freezing temperatures to help get rid of that accumulated snow and ice that's left. Partly cloudy, upper 30s overnight. Tomorrow, gusty. Uh, we could see wind gusts upwards of 20, 30 miles per hour as that front comes through. And there you can see temperatures tumbling a little bit. Into the weekend, warming up again, but unfortunately it looks like a, a better chance for rain heading our way.